Hi, my name is Kayla, and I got pregnant when I was still in elementary school. I was fucking eating crayons. How the fuck are you getting goddamn pregnant? All right, what's up, guys? My name is Sasuke Shokust, and in today's video, we're going to be reacting to just something dumb. I was really bored, and I really didn't feel like playing hours and hours and hours of Fortnite content to just go and try and find, like, someone that was, like, super toxic or something in creative fill, so... I decided to do one of these, I've watched these a lot, and I personally enjoy them a ton. Especially when the person just like, flames the living hell out of the person. And they're all animated, and they're, they're dumb. Anyways, so, let's get into the video. School. I grew up in this really small island. We had few neighbors, and children didn't get to go to public school. Wait, so how did you get pregnant? Uh-huh. Okay, so hold on. So let's just talk about this real quick. This... What even that? You look like a goddamn toothbrush. Anyways, you look like a goddamn brush that I used to paint a goddamn fucking canvas. Yeah, I'm gonna paint me losing my virginity in elementary school. Anyways. So that's what it's saying. Whatever. You don't have public schooling, but you got pregnant. Wouldn't you go to, like, uh, to a Catholic school and be like, Oh, uh, Jesus is great, or some goddamn crap? What? Whatever, I can't even be bothered at this point. Whatever, just, 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 just play, play. Uh, I'm gonna lose IQ. To study, I would have to travel many miles every day, and my parents could. So you traveled many hours just to bang a random dude in a locker? Okay, bitch. Could afford it. My mom and dad wanted a better future for me, and they began saving up every penny they earned. It was a hard time. Whoa, 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 whoa! Was it? Was that like a golden coin? Hold on. Was that a golden ass coin? What, what the hell? I want to go back to that. Hold up. Many miles every day. And my parents couldn't afford it. Uh, I just want to repeat. That's a fucking gold coin. That bitch is probably worth a lot more than a fucking penny. <laughs> yeah, n nice pennies, bitch. Whatever. It was a hard time because we had little to eat and my parents worked almost all day long. I had to help out a lot around the house, even if I was really young. I can't thank my parents enough for everything they did for me. Let, what, like, letting you get pregnant in elementary school? Look, I'm sorry I paused this video, but this... This goddamn toothbrush looking ass bitch is trying to tell me that she went to school and that she got pregnant on a private island. What, were you in Hawaii? No, wasn't that beautiful? Where the hell were you? In Abu Dhabi? Goddamn. It's not even an island. Shut up. Don't, don't yell at me. And I know I disappointed them by getting pregnant when I was so young. I hope I can make it up to them and repay them for all their effort and love. When I was nine years old, they managed to save up enough money to move to America. I knew a little English, but it was hard starting from scratch. I had a lot to learn, and I had never... Whoa, whoa, whoa. D d does... Bitch, I'm pretty sure that says high school. J just saying. Just saying. I never gone to school at all before arriving to the USA. Everything was new to me. Growing up in such a small island, I wasn't used to the busy streets or being sur- Okay, look, I'm, I'm a dog guy, and look at- What is that image? Okay, guys, if you don't know, I'm looking closer to my monitor. I'm trying to figure out what the hell I'm looking at. What, what's, what's, what's with this kid? Like, what, what the hell? He, he just looks, like, so pissed off, and the mother's like, Ah, you ungrateful little shit. That just looks- that just looks weird. Whatever, continue. Surrounded by lots of people. I wasn't used to the fast-paced life of the city, either. It was all so foreign and odd to me. Oh, this is all so odd. Let's just go. I got a baby. What was worse, I was older than my classmates when my mom and dad finally managed to get me enrolled in a public school. I was really eager to learn, though, so I studied hard and paid attention to my teachers. I did my homework every evening and practiced speaking and writing in English. Dad worked two jobs, and that allowed mom to take care of me when I wasn't at school. That was also a big change, because they usually didn't have enough time to be around me often. I was really happy about this. Okay, look, I'm sorry, but I'm just trying to fi find out what, what the hell you're on about getting pregnant in elementary school. Like, you're talking about, oh, I grew up rough. Why are you giving me the sad story when you got pregnant in elementary school? Let's continue, I guess. I was a kid and really needed my mom to be by my side. She helped me with my homework and motivated me to be responsible. I became a great student, and my teachers considered allowing me to skip a grade. 
since I didn't have any previous education, they decided against it, even if it meant I was older than my classmates, and I showed promise. Perhaps, they told me, I would be able to skip a grade or two when I reached high school. Sixth grade arrived, and everything was going well. You just got out of elementary school, and you're not pregnant yet? The video's clickbait, clickbait, clickbait. My parents had both managed to get far better jobs. Dad was able to be home every night, and we... What the hell are you eating? It looks like a goddamn pizza. It looks like a pasta, pasta pizza. Like, look at this. You look like you just made a pizza. Slap that on a plate. It's like those microwavable pizzas that take three minutes in the microwave. You get a full-ass pizza. Not good. And it looks like you just slapped some noodles on it. And what the hell is this? That's some fucking jelly beans. All right, now I'm hungry. Not off the pizza, but off the jelly beans. We were living in a nice apartment in a better neighborhood. My life was a lot better than it had ever been at the island. I had friends. I was studying. We lived in a nice place. Mom and Dad could actually spend time with me, and we even had enough money to afford nicer clothes and furniture. We were not rich or anything of the sort, but it was more than enough for us. That was when I met this really nice guy named Brad. I fell in love with him immediately. My parents allowed. Yeah, it looks like you fell too close in love with him. Biatch. Allowed us to date because it seemed like it was so innocent. After all, we were both still so young. We spent a lot of time together. It was so much fun, and I loved kissing him. Two things. One, so we're going to assume she's in, like, 7th or 8th grade. And she's already... Oh, I love... Hold on, this is her. Oh, I love kissing him. I love the way it made me feel. God damn... One night, while my mom was working overtime, we stayed home alone. We began having too much fun. Oh, you don't think, Mrs. Pregnant Pants? And one thing led to another. At first, I... Oh, man, one thing led to another. Oh, I, I just loved kissing him, and then his, his pee-pee just fell right into my... I didn't notice anything was different. A few weeks passed by, and I began getting sick in the morning. Mom got concerned, but since I felt better after a while, she brushed it off as the flu. I didn't want her to be concerned, so I pretended I didn't feel queasy most mornings. I kept going to school and studying as normal, but things kept getting weird. My stomach began swelling up, and by then I knew that something was wrong. I talked to Brad first, and we figured out I was pregnant. I com- Wait, 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 wait. D didn't that sign just say high school? I'm gonna rewind that back and just- let, let it on the screen. Did I just say high school? Or did I miss it? Roast me in the comments if I'm wrong, but like... What? Whatever. This video's clickbait. I was scammed. Completely freaked out and didn't want to tell my parents anything about it, but there wasn't anything else I could do. That night, I blurted the news out in the middle of dinner. I was too up... So... Okay, let's get this straight. You're not poor... Okay, that dude looks like a loaf of bread. I can't get over that. Holy crap. Get your goddamn loaf of bread ass out of here. Anyways. So, they apparently can afford nice clothes, nice furniture. They can't afford to get out of their microwave pizza with pasta out of here. They must be Italian. I'm calling it. I'm upset to try and calmly explain it to them. My parents were incredibly mad. They scolded me for hours and couldn't believe I could have gotten pregnant since I was so young. They took me to the doctor and wanted to confirm if it was true. After a quick echography and a blood test, it was confirmed. I was expecting a baby. The doctor told them I was over four months pregnant. Why does every dude in this look like a goddamn loaf of bread? Except her boyfriend that looks like a... I don't even know what to say about her boyfriend. And not even a boyfriend. You better become a goddamn husband or you're a goddamn son of a... So there was no other choice but to keep the baby. When we got back to our home, my mom and dad started arguing. Dad said I was ruining my life and mom... Okay, I'm just not noticing this. He looks like a piece of bread. She looks like an egg. What, are we having scrambled eggs and toast? That's a serious question. I, I, I want breakfast. I, I skip it because that's what I do. And all I had was a soda. Like, come on. Man, these animated bastards are getting me hungry. ...said that they needed to support me. I was their daughter, and even if I had messed up, they couldn't turn their back on me. 
They called Brad's parents, and the four of them met up. Brad and I were terrified, and all the adults were furious. They explained that they would support... Hold on, real quick. Okay, so they're sad, right? Whatever. And then, if we look at the... I'm gonna skip this. They look like... They all look like twins! Looks like they're like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna copy and paste this face over here, I'm gonna copy, copy and paste this face over here, and then, uh, you don't get a... As much, uh, beard as him, you get sh little longer hair, uh, you get some different clothes. Alright, alright, call it a video. That's what they did. Looks stupid. All the adults were furious. They explained that they would support us, but that the baby would be our responsibility. We would have to keep studying, and when we arrived... That sign said middle school? I was scammed. I want a refund. Arrived home from school, we'd take care of our son or daughter. We agreed immediately, of course, not only because it was the right thing to do, but because we were both terrified of our parents' anger. I continued studying all through my pregnancy. I was very lucky since both my parents and Brad's mom and dad really were there for us every step of the way. Against all odds, Brad and I continued dating all through high school. When we graduated, we moved in together with our daughter, Lucy. Uh there's no way in the living L that they would be that young. That that kid would be that young. Okay, we're gonna do some math. So at most, at most, in my middle school, so she's she's older than everyone else. So we'll say 15. We'll say Brad's 14. Okay, that's middle school. She gives birth at the end of middle school, so well, about like 15. This is like saying on the high end, by the way. Then they have four years, and then they graduate college, so assuming like a bachelor's degree at least, they're saying eight years, the baby looks like she's one. That baby would be walking, would be caking you, would be... And I I don't even want to swear, but like, come on. Come on. Make the baby grow up, goddamn. We have a great relationship and get along so well with all four of my daughter's grandparents. We are a happy family and are doing great. We both have good jobs and plan on having more children in a few years. Oh, are you going to wait till you go back to college for that? Sometimes people think that I'm Lucy's sister instead of her mom. There we go. Jesus. It took you that long to show the kid grown up. You're like, oh yeah, we moved out. We moved into a house. We got, we went through college. We got good jobs. And she's two. No, she is like nine or ten or something dumb. I'm getting very mad over a goddamn cartoon. God damn it. Whatever, play the video. Um, but we don't mind. We worked really hard to raise her well, and we will continue to try and give her the best life possible. Thanks for watching. No, I don't want to. I don't want to hear your goddamn stupid ass freaking toothbrush looking. I don't even know what to say about this lady. Okay, so we're gonna dissect what the hell we just watched. Okay, I got pregnant in elementary school. Fine, whatever. Accidents happen. His pee, pee just slipped in. Whatever. I don't care. I want to look at the comments. Because last time I tried to do a video like this, my computer just said, oh yeah, no, we're going to corrupt whatever the hell that bitch was saying because it was stupid. And then yeah, we're going to go and uh, yeah, do middle fingers for me. Yep, that that's great. Love it. Anyways, I watched a different one. I don't watch this one. The comments just roasted it. <laughs> like, I was like, I was eating crayons in elementary school. You were just banging in the locker. What the Okay, let's go check out. All right. All right, here we go. And we're living in a nice apartment in the neighborhood. Show's house. <laughs> I didn't even notice that. This is a certified bro moment. Bro. I gotta agree with that. Not nearly spicy enough. Shut up. <laughs> Thumbnail. I got pregnant in elementary school. Video. I got pregnant in middle school. Yep, that sounds about right. What the hell have I just watched? Exactly. And you know what you gotta like. Notice how they all have blue eyes. Hmm. How do you get pregnant in elementary school? Cloud Magic. How old was she? <laughs> what the hell is this video? <laughs> so this one isn't nearly as popular as what I've watched. But like they're still just like, what, 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 what's going on? <laughs> just like having a brain aneurysm over this. Oh my god. That, that's that's good. That's good. All right, guys, so I'm done. I'm tired. I got to go make a thumbnail for this bit. <laughs> but no, I hope you guys did enjoy it. Uh, I'm going to be playing my new outro. 
Uh, let me know if you guys like it. If you do like these videos also, I like making them. I just get to roast the lady. Like, come on. <laughs> but <laughs> that kid, I can't get over. Oh, yeah. The kid's two years old, even though we're like, we're like 25 and we had the kid at like 14. Come on. If you're going to do this dumb crap, at least make it better. Like just make it, make it more believable. Like, come on. <laughs> Whatever. Hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, leave a like if you want. Subscribe if you want more of this content. Or you just want me to go do some Fortnite dumb crap. Um, yeah, hope you guys did enjoy. I'll see you guys in the next video. Deuces.